If you started playing this game pretty long ago, you probably know that the way how it worked before is different compared to what we have now. For a long time I thought it doesn't even work, but after Hecate was added, I noticed that character moves much slower with it than usual. After that I started testing movement speed with different combinations of weapons and found out how it works. So in today's video we will talk about weight, how it works and how much does it affect on your movement speed. Firstly let's look at the way it works. Me and my friend took stock MP5s and stock pistols, but in my case it was Glock 17 while my friend had a Dignal. After that we started running in the same direction and to make it easier to see the difference, I started running further from him. And slowly I caught up with him after a while, and in this way we can make conclusion about two things. First of all, it doesn't matter what weapon you are holding at the moment. Secondly, that secondary weapon also has effect on your movement speed. So we can make a conclusion that in our game we have overall weight, which is based on what primary and secondary you have. Let's find out how much does weight decrease your movement speed. I will tell and show you how I made all these calculations, but I know that almost all of you just gonna skip this part. So instead of that I'm gonna tell you what problems I had while calculating all this stuff. First of all, there is no normal speed. If you played this game during Operation Viper, you may know that if you didn't have any weapon in your hand, you had normal or maximum speed. After a few tests, I made the conclusion that if character hadn't any weight, his speed would be 18 feet per second. After another test, I noticed that in tests with bigger weight, difference in movement speed wasn't big enough as it's supposed to be. Firstly, I thought that it's because of an accuracy in tests, but then I just understood that there was some regression. Few words, the more weight you have, the less impact each gram will have on your movement speed. So if this regression wouldn't exist, with heavy weapons you would move much slower than you actually do. Talking about weight effect on movement speed itself, it's pretty hard to notice different in most cases. The only exception is when you are playing with something really heavy. If you want to calculate your movement speed, you just need to put overall weight instead of X in this formula. I will leave it in the description. Even though these numbers are not 100% accurate, main purpose of this video wasn't about numbers exactly. I wanted you to understand how it works firstly, doesn't matter what weapon you are holding, and that your weight is based on your primary and secondary. Secondly, that weight doesn't decrease your movement speed that much as you may think. But it doesn't mean that you can put 10 sniper scopes, 40 lasers and 40 flash I want you not to limit yourself when it comes about using useful attachments like increased max and specially grips and muzzle attachments. But if it's possible, you should compensate them with attachments which decrease weight of weapon and don't impact on its effectiveness. For example, for HK you can use Polymac instead of Stock Magazine, which is absolutely the same but with lower weight. Or for example, PDW Handguard instead of Stock 1. Let me show you how to make such builds. Weight of stock MK18 is 3,191 grams, and here's my build that has bigger weight only by 61 grams. But it has extended barrel and lower recoil by 6 points. With increased mech it will be 215 grams, which is still not a big difference. And if you want to make effective builds of your weapons, you must do it in the same way. And last thing about weight, if you don't use your pistol too often, you can take lock, because it has the lowest weight among all pistols. And it's pretty good pistol in the same time. If you found this video useful, leave a like and some comment, it helps a lot with promoting of my videos. Join my Discord server, which has the best builds for our weapons and game modes, tier lists, and useful information about this game. And see you next weekend. Oh, давай. Нормально, превьюшка. Yeah. <laughs>